There is a turbulence. There is a racial turbulence that all we do is pass one generation to another. I want to preside over a season of repair in this country. Americans are hardwired for great things, not small incremental things. There's a difference between reparations and race-based policies. Race-based policies is economic restitution, but in a way it's a continuation of the same paternalistic patterns. I messed with you and now I'll tell you how I'm gonna fix you. Reparations is different, it carries moral force because it carries an inherent mea culpa, an inherent acknowledgement of a wrong that has been done, of a debt that is owed, and the willingness on the part of a people to pay it. CBS did a study, if black Americans who have the same level of, of, of professional and educational achievement as whites earned as much money as whites, our economy would be $1.5 trillion larger. So let's be very clear. If we pay between 200 and $500 billion to be dispersed over 20 years to a reparations council made up themselves of descendants of slaves, so that it's theirs to decide, within a stipulation that the U.S. government means projects of economic and educational renewal, this will not be a debt. This will be an asset, this will be a benefit, this will be an economic stimulus, and even more than that, our generation will know we had a problem, and on that and on a lot of things, we rose up and we fixed those problems. <clears throat>